I was inspired to create the movie by the piece itself on stage. I mean, it's such an extraordinary musical. I saw it in the original production in 1987. It's a very special piece because it has so much to say. I mean, it's very clever, obviously, and very original and smart, but it also has a lot of heart and warmth and it says a lot about the parent-child relationship, which I think is important, and, and about the consequences of wishes. And so all of that in uh, one musical is sort of extraordinary. And I was thrilled to bring it to screen. Um, uh, something I was, you know, I felt incredibly honored to do. You know, when, you, when, you, when you're lucky enough to get a Golden Globe nomination for your film, it's this wonderful surprise, it's this wonderful um, feeling, I think, you, you get because it, you, you, you've been acknowledged and, you know, you don't take something like that for granted. It's very special and rare. Um, you know, there are a lot of great movies out there, a lot of great movies out there. So when you're singled out like that in some way, you feel very humbled by it. And uh, I think we all feel that way. To have Steven Sondheim working on the film was invaluable because he's the original creator. The great thing was he really understood that it needed to be reimagined for film. And that's something rare, I think, because um, a lot of composers, lyricists hold on very tight to the material. He wasn't like that at all. He really wanted to make sure it worked as a film first. Um, so he's a great collaborator. So was James Lapine, who wrote the screenplay, who wrote the original as well. I mean, I, I, I felt very fortunate to have them by my side as we made this into a movie. I mean, there was a little pressure from the fans, um, uh, you know, who loved this piece. But, you know, the truth is I love this piece, too. And so I kind of appreciated their passion. I mean, I had the same passion. I really wanted to make sure it worked as a film. I wanted to retain what uh, the, the, that uh, the sort of central core of what you have on stage. But I wanted to make sure it worked as a movie. That was the most important thing. And I, I, I hopefully we were, we were able to do that. Anna's great because she plays a very modern Cinderella and she's a very modern girl herself, you know? She's very complex and, and has a sort of her own sensibility. Cinderella is a real individual, very much her own woman, and, um, and discovers that during the, the film. And it was perfect for Anna because of that. She also is an amazing singer and has enormous talent in that department, so that was a perfect match. And there's no one like Johnny Depp. I, I, I adore working with Johnny Depp. I worked with him on Pirates of the Caribbean. And he's very um, unique. He's um, the kindest man I think you'll ever meet. Very generous person, but also a creative force. Um, loves to jump into uh, a character, make it his own, make it playful and fun, which I think was important when you're working with a child, you know, to have that sort of playful sensibility. He brought that to it and that sort of mischievous, wonderful joie de vivre that he has. Um, uh, I was thrilled to work with him on this again, and um, I think he was excited to be part of a company and not sort of be the lead, but have a smaller role and be part of the, on, this wonderful ensemble of people. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys, huh? Is that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey!